During the process of meiosis, there are several unique events. And what we mean by unique events here is that these are things that do not happen during mitosis. So these would only happen during the meiosis process. If we talk about those unique events, one of those is going to be the pairing up of homologous chromosomes. These homologous chromosomes are going to be the chromosomes that have pretty much the same kind of information on them, but they probably do have different versions of the genes on them. So the actual coming together and the forming of the tetrads is what we're talking about here. This is something that's going to happen during prophase one. And during prophase one, we're going to get that synapsis process. Synapsis would be the very careful lining up of the homologous chromosomes, placing those identical loci, those same positions, those same genes, right across from each other. So that is a unique event for meiosis. Now, when we do have the coming together of the homologous chromosomes and the forming of the tetrads, we also have the important event of crossing over that takes place. So crossing over occurs. This crossing over that takes place is also going to happen during prophase one. And in this process right here, this is going to be an exchange of chromosome pieces. And when we say chromosome pieces, we're talking about DNA fragments are actually being swapped. This is specifically between the non-sister chromatids And the end result of this is that we're going to produce recombinant chromosomes. Recombinant chromosomes are going to be chromosomes that have new combinations of the gene versions. So new combinations that weren't there before. When we're drawing them in our pictures, a lot of times these are represented as chromosomes that are composed of maybe two different colors. So maybe they have um, a blue chromosome with a red tip on it or something along those lines. Those are unique events. Just the tetras themselves are unique events, and that really goes up here because these pairs of chromosomes, homologous chromosomes, those are the tetrads. But another thing that's unique to meiosis is the lining up of the tetrads. The tetrads themselves, they line up on the metaphase plate, and this is specifically during metaphase one. So a number of unique events that we're seeing right here, um, these are things that happen during meiosis one specifically. If we were to list a number four event, a fourth thing that's unique is that we do get separation of the homologous chromosomes. So separation of the homologs would be another way to say that. And when we're talking about um, separation of the homologous chromosomes, that process right there is something that will occur or take place during um, anaphase one. Okay, so um, quite a list here of things that happen only during meiosis. Actually, all of the things that we've listed here are things that would happen specifically during meiosis one.